All right, welcome back to Crimson Glass on YouTube. This is part six of Revising Broken Girl. And the last entry you had for me was a very drunken rant about something on Thursday. It was the only video I managed to both film and edit that day because after I edited Broken Girl and uploaded it, I was no longer, well, I don't know. I was drunk by six o'clock because I just had a terrible mental health day. And I just, yes, terrible, health, health, terrible mental health day. You should go immediately start drinking as soon as you are done working which is what I did. I waited until 308 and then I opened up the margaritas. And I'm, <laughs> I don't do it that often. So I think that's why it's okay. Like it's my way of relaxing. And like, that's when I, when I get that stress, I have to let it all go. And the only way I know how to let it all go is to get rip roaring toasted. And <laughs> so, and then, but the good thing is because I was out of alcohol by six o'clock and I didn't walk up to get more alcohol. I was drunk by six, buzzed by eight and fine in the morning to go to work. Like, cause I had to work again the next day. So I guess afternoon drinking is where it's at. But you are here for a revising Broken Girl. Um, up until third, last week was a crapshoot. Last week was bad um, for a couple of reasons. And I'm not going to get into the weeds here because that's for my um, Patreon. But basically, I had decided to add two chapters kind of in the towards the end of Act 2 where it was after the Manny kidnapping and then before the spring carnival, I'd added two chapters and I wrote one of the chapters. I'm like, I don't hate it. And I'll probably end up posting on Patreon at some point. But then I had to write a second chapter and neither of those chapters were doing quite what I wanted them to do. So on Saturday, yes, Saturday, I did a crazy thing and I threw out both chapters and I thought, what do I need this? Why am I adding scenes here? What do I actually need to happen in this time period between these two chapters that originally existed? And I needed just a couple of things. I needed Lucky and Liz to come to a realization that it's not about the abuse. It's actually just about, like, they don't get each other anymore. And I wanted to make Jesse more of an asshole because <laughs> that's the thing I'm doing. Um, I wanted to do something with Elizabeth and Carly. And I wanted to do, like, something with Lucky trying anger management and realizing it's not a good match for domestic abusers, which is what he's going to learn. So, like, I wanted to do a couple of things, and, like, I realized I didn't need eight scenes to do any of that stuff. I only needed four, so I just ended up tossing two chapters and keeping one, which is what revisions are for. And then once I did that, I was fine. Um, on sa So, on Saturday, I wrote 6,000 words. I wrote the new chapter. I edited two more chapters, and then yesterday, I edited four more chapters. And then today, I have about four more to finish. Um, I have three scenes left to write. They're really quick scenes because the ending scene in this chap the chapter, the chapter I'm editing, it's... um. I had split a chapter into two to add a scene at the, a couple scenes at the PCD, PCPD. And then there was like a 2000 Jason Elizabeth scene at the end. So I really just needed these three scenes to do about 2,500 words among them. So it's like 800 words. I can do 2,500 words in like an hour. So like that's, and these are basic just A, B, C, D. Like I have to meet a couple of pop points. And then the rest of it's just editing and fixing a couple of things. So like I am going to start that at Let's see, it is 12.30 now. I broke for lunch and filming at 12. So I'm going to go finish this up, go eat lunch, and then come back. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start writing between 1 and 4. I'm still dealing with student emails. In fact, let me pull up my phone to make sure I'm not missing any because they love to email me. Nope, it's just people excited about the Blue Angels thing. Super my All right. So I'm going to finish that today. I am going to finish. I have the entire afternoon blocked out. I got... I woke up early. I got all my attendance done. I got everything that needs to get done today done in the last four hours. I busted my ass to do it so that I could have the afternoon free. Because I'm going to finish Broken Girl today. This is the day. We're going to do it. Um, I'm really excited to finally be putting the story to bed. I am excited about the changes now that I have fixed the changes. And it was really funny. I, I decided to add like 34 new scenes when I first went through. And then as I came to write them, I realized... I really don't need all of this. I really don't need the scene here and the scenes. There's like three or four scenes that I get just outright eliminated, including. So that's kind of like the interesting thing about revisions. Like you think you need these things and then you go back through and maybe you don't. I still have to do one more complete read through after the beta draft. Um, Cause the beta draft is here's all the new crap pushed in together. And then I'm going to send it out to my Patreons at the $5 level. And then I'm going to read it through one more time, this time for um, mostly just typos and inconsistencies, like little things. And then I'm going to see how the flow works. And hopefully I won't have to add or change anything from this point on. I'll just be editing work. And then I'm going to make the ebook. Um, the ebook is for my $7 Patreons. They'll get the posting draft, which is all cleaned up. And then they'll also get the ebook. So... We are, and then May 4th, um, on Sunday, uh, my Patreon subscribers at the $1 level, they'll get all of the chapters I'm posting next week. So they'll get the prologue through chapter three, 
all on Sunday. And then um, every week they'll get the chat. So Monday, M Monday, Wednesday, but it's next week. Wow, I can't believe it's finally. Like, I feel like I've been living with this book forever. I can't wait for people to actually read it. So, all right. I have really enjoyed making this series. I hope that some of you guys enjoyed watching it. Um, I will try and do these for all of my projects if this is something you enjoy. It does help me, especially when I do the Patreon videos, which are a lot more in depth and they're available at the $1 level because of there's like 40 of them because I love to, to just ramble. I don't know if you've noticed, but like I will ramble about stories forever. But I can't today because I actually do have to eat lunch. All right. Bye.